Good morning, everyone. This is Brad Matheny. Today's the 25th of June. This is the SPY uh, daily chart. We're going back over my continuing plan your trade um, video series. It's going to be a short video today highlighting the uh, SPY cycle patterns. Remember, yesterday I had gone down to an hourly chart. We'll go down to 30 minutes and we are going to highlight what I expected to see happen in the markets uh throughout the day and as you can see we saw a very big uh rotation of the downside followed by an end of day close very strongly down here to the 542 level i do remember very clearly suggesting this 542 to 543 roughly 542.50 543 area you can see the areas that i've drawn here indicating that this would be very deep support down here, down in this area. Now I get this to move up a little. So you can see here how I had drawn hypothetically moving like this, closing over here in a potentially 542.90 to 543 area, and how I expect today to now be a fairly solid rally day based on my SPY cycle patterns, uh, indicating that this is a base rally day. And I do believe that we're going to see the SPY move up on stronger volume and attempt to close above 546. So I will draw this over here. Roughly somewhere over in this area would be my minimum expectation for the markets. Um, we are currently at 543.64, up just a little bit. Um, remember, on a daily basis now, you know, my expectations for yesterday were down in this area, um, and now we're moving back up with a higher high, possibly up into the 548 area. These were lines that I drew indicating general trends. So I'm kind of going to stick to these blue lines as we move forward. This gives you a very clear understanding of, you know, what I expect to see happen. We're down here near support. We may get a little tossling around down here in this area, 542, 542.50. Um, but I expect to see a fairly strong upward trend today. Could be a nice solid rally. Uh, and then the following day, we're going to see a move up again. You can see here, possibly up in the 550 area, maybe a little higher. Then we get a consolidation day over here on the 27th. So again, nice and solid today's your opportunity for a pretty good upward trend sit back and get ready uh it looks like we're going to see quite a bit of bullish activity this day played out pretty darn well we didn't see the early morning selling that i expected but we did ultimately see the downward day uh and remember these spy cycle patterns are predicted weeks and months in advance so this bullish rally phase that we're in right now, uh, base rally phase is what it's called. Um, it was predicted literally eight, nine, 10 months ago plus. Uh, if you wanna really know the fact, it was predicted more than four years ago. Uh, but again, we will see what happens and how it plays out. See if we get our base rally, see if we get a continued rally topping back over here, and then see if we get our consolidation and our crush pattern on Friday. So again, I'm kind of just letting it play out, see how my analysis uh, plays out. You can see again, they've kind of drawn these lines here. This is a good example. Coming up, rolling down, look how it rolled down this day, moving in this area, moving down to a low here in this red line, moving up through here, moving up through here, and then moving back down all the way down. So the red line and the blue lines give us a pretty good indication of what I've drawn as expected price action. Remember, it's about planning your trade. You know, the idea that knowing or at least having some better clue as to what is potentially coming and how to uh, expect some sort of a price move gives you a pretty solid definition. Like this big gap that occurred on, on uh, <clears throat> uh, Friday, uh, the 21st, leading into this rally phase here gave you a pretty good indication that you could short into the SPY trying to move into the day. Today, we get a good solid rally. So we're up at 543.65. We're up just a little bit. 
we need to see this continue to build some momentum to the upside and really probably get above, you know, 544, 543.90, maybe 544. So hypothetically, I would say that any real strong rally is going to occur above that level. So we need to get uh, above basically 540, uh, call it 544 uh, um, on the SPY. If we can't get above 544 in early trading, then we could get a really solid short squeeze into the end of the day. If we stay consolidated down in this area, then we might see a big pop in the afternoon to the upside. Okay, guys, that's it. Remember, plan your trade. Check out my videos. Learn how to do this more effectively. And it looks like you've got a nice solid 24-hour window here of upward activity. So get ready. This is a uh, this is, again, trying to plan your trade effectively, learning when the opportunity sits and how to jump on it. Okay, guys.